Here we are under my 93 Chevy Silverado with the 5.7 liter 350. Had a leak here from my oil filter adapter. This is the part that bolts up to the, the engine block. And there's an O-ring that goes in here. And there's a flat gasket that goes on here. And this goes up into the truck you know, this way. So this is the bottom you'd be looking at here. So I've already taken it apart, cleaned it out. I went one step further to make it easy. I took the drive shaft out. Um, it's easy to do because uh, there's just uh, four bolts there, four bolts back here. That's what the drive shaft looks like over there. This is what it looks like looking up into here. I also removed this this brace that goes over here. Let's see if I can get that in the frame there. This brace, this piece here, bolts up to here. So it's kind of going across in front of things. So I, I took, you don't need to take the drive shaft out, but I did take it out. And you can see where that fits up in there. So, so that flat washer or flat gasket fits up into here. And it seals, seals the bolts also. And the O-ring rides here. So you gotta make sure you get all that gasket out of here. The one that was in here was like hard as a rock. This piece was like a hard piece of plastic. If it started out as an, a regular O-ring, it was flat. I don't know if it was a flat O-ring, but it was brittle like a piece of plastic. So I cleaned this thing all up so I can I can just put it back up in there. Oil filter goes on right here. So we're going to go ahead and put that back up in there and then do an oil change and a new filter at the same time. This is the gasket kit I bought. It's a Felpro. There's the part number. That's kind of what it looks like. opened it let's, it's like it's got some extra gaskets in there for other model years this is the gasket I'm gonna need this o-ring and this one here to do mine mine's a k2500 four-wheel drive so these are the two I need my old gasket looked like this so it's flat it was an o-ring it's pretty flat it's hard as a it's very hard it's actually getting softer as it said here but uh, when I took them out they just broke into pieces this is this this gasket is part of this one here that's really brittle it just breaks Anyway, this, there it is, it's, it just snaps, it's hard. So, we're going to put these two in. Okay, it's all back in there. I've already fired it up, no leaks. Five shafts back in. My Wix filter on there. Wix filter I use is 51036. 
was leaking from this side. It was leaking from right in here. It's gurgling and spitting out right here where that O-ring is. So, 